Are you committed to your goals Are you, or are you just interested? Lessons from an eight-year-old. Last night, we had a proud parent moment regarding our eight-year-old daughter. So I get this message from my wife that uh, she had taken the kids to soccer practice or was taking the kids to soccer practice. And she later tells me that prior to taking them there, my oldest daughter, who's eight years old, had said something to the effect of she was really tired, didn't really feel like going to practice tonight. And actually as parents, we understood because it's been a really jam packed um, last week, really with sports and practices and games and everything going on. So we were actually willing to, you know, let her out of going to practice as long as she made sure she went to goalie practice for the soccer league next week. We were willing to give her a pass knowing that, hey, that's a lot to put on an eight-year-old. Long story short, she also included in that message how, how my oldest daughter thought for 30 minutes. She was just going to not make any rush decisions, but she took it upon herself, by the way, how mature of her to do, right? And, and thought about it for 30 minutes. And, and she comes back to my wife and says, you know, mom, um, I'm going to go. I'm gonna go. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go to practice. It just doesn't feel right not to go. I can't tell you how proud of a parent moment that was, because she took it upon herself. She made the decision. She actually took the time to process and think through things like, "Geez, what would the the consequences of that be? How would that look to my teammates? Am I being a good teammate or a bad teammate if I just bail on them and not go to practice tonight?" And all that leading to say this, here at the locker room, we often say things uh, about, are you committed or are you just interested? And this is a lesson right here in and of itself that my eight-year-old daughter, God love her, was committed. Because what we say is commitment is doing what you said you were going to do long after the feeling or emotion in which you said it has passed. It's operating out of integrity, doing what you said you were going to do. I signed up to play soccer. I signed up to go to this extra practice for goalies. And she committed to it. And in a moment when she didn't really feel like going, she did it anyways, right? And I think that's such a lesson in commitment. Whereas being interested, it's more about convenience, more about dabbling, right? It's, it's like, hey, look, if, if it works out, great, or I'll come to the party, basically if nothing else better shows up, that's just being interested in something. And in that moment, our children can teach us so much, right? She was committed. She did what she said she was gonna do long after the feeling or emotion when she said it has passed. She made a decision, right? And when I make a decision, that means decide. Side literally means to kill off, that I've, I've, I've blocked everything else out. Nothing else matters. This is what I'm doing. I've said no to complacency, mediocrity, being average, excuses, all the stuff because I've made a decision. And I look back and I look at my daughter, I'm thinking, wow, what a moment. What a mature decision-making moment when she was not really feeling it. We've all been there. I don't want to lead generate today. I don't want to follow up. I don't want to deal with this client, whatever the case may be, but you suck it up and you do it anyways because you committed to it. You decided. Our success is not going to be any, be any more convenient six months from now than it is today. And yet a lot of people just walk around interested, pretending as if they're really committed. News resolutions is a great example. New year, new me, I'm gonna lose that weight. It's gonna be the best year of my life. I'm gonna have that dream job, blah, 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 blah. And yet two weeks, let alone six months goes by and we've all but forgotten. That was in that moment more interested than we were committed in having made it made a decision. So I just wanna give you that today in this short video about commitment versus being interested. Are you committed? to your goals are you or are you just interested lessons from an eight-year-old there you go we'll see you guys later